$72. 72 okay. That right there is what we're gonna catch some big old car with. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna run out of line. I'm gonna have to set it. Oh. That's a fish in the zone. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Yo. Oh my god. Yo. 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 I think you broke another record. Oh my god, I'm wearing a hoodie and it's like 110 outside. Welcome back everybody. By the way, first thing, merch is gonna be gone tonight. Not this shirt, but the other shirt that says I'm Bricked. It's gonna be taken off at midnight. You'll never be able to buy it again. So, one day we do hit 375 million subscribers. You might have a, I don't know, you might have like a $150 shirt. It might not be $19 anymore, so. Just wanted to let you know, but welcome back. No, so, uh, I don't know if y'all remember, but last year I went on a, Bobby, can you shut your mouth? When I'm trying to portray like a cinema event your loud voice doesn't help thank you I don't know if you guys remember last year but I went on a endeavor of trying to catch a massive alligator gar it was like my dream fish so to be go time versus you good I tightly and loosen it after you uh, hit her you know just so she can run a little bit there you go do it again there you go Ooh, get her get her get her this is it there you go there you go bro. almost took you in <laughs> Come on, Bertha. Come on, Bertha. Oh! Oh! oh my gosh! Look at the size of its tail. It's bigger than my head. Oh. Oh, there you go. Did she just growl? Well, I almost ended up breaking the world record, and this year I'm going to. I know you're probably like, how do you know that? Because uh, I'm confident. And that was what we were planning to do in this video. We were filming more of like a documentary of trying to break it. And then it didn't really go as planned. So just wanted to let you know, we started yesterday morning that with that intention. It got absolutely buck wild, but everything here going on at the house is good. Stephanius and uh, the pigs are fine. The fish that we got to are also chilling under here. Hi, how's it going? That's just an update. Click the subscribe button if you're new. And I'm gonna throw you back to yesterday when uh, we filmed practically an episode of River Monsters. The, the dogs think I'm taking I'm taking him on a walk because I have a leash. Actually, I'm using this for an alligator gar. So, nope, it's uh, not for you. You guys, I don't think you understand how much goes into trying to catch one of these things. At least trying to catch one of this size, right? We've got knives, we have tape measures, we have a leash, we have headlamps, we have towels. We're gonna need to go get a, get a, like a big five gallon water bottle so you can pour on yourself after you're done. You're in the Trinity River, like I said, very, very dirty. By the time it's said and done, can't get back in the car without literally using that to shower and wipe off. It's a mission and a half. We just got off the phone, uh, trying to plan out how we're gonna do the whole thing. All the bends are far from access points. That's the issue. I see all of them around the bends. I mean, stupid rivers, they always go through private property. That's the issue is like, we would literally have to trespass pretty much any other spot we're thinking of unless we go really far down but we didn't have nearly the size luck that we had when we filmed the series with John. So I'm thinking maybe if anything, move a little bit farther north. There's like a water treatment plant a little bit north. Going back to that bridge and, and trying to catch the exact same fish I caught last year. You think it would just sit there? No. I think maybe one of its friends will. If we left in, we leave in like an hour 30. That puts us leaving at, what, 2.50? Okay, all right, I'm gonna call him. Uh, all right, I think we're going today. I think we're going. We weren't planning on going because we had no mode of transportation, but we're gonna try and do it. No! What the hell is even that? Did they replay that in the news? Like, this is the kid who caught the world record alligator guard. <laughs> yeah, it is actually. Watch, see that? You saw that clip? Oh. Oh. oh my goodness. Saw that hook set? I probably whiffed. <laughs> but it's okay because the next one I'm gonna land him. We're gonna go battle some. Oh, oh, oh. Ah. What was the plan? I was gonna jump up and down. Uh, we're gonna move it to tomorrow. Now that that's planned out, where we're gonna go, what we're gonna do, we just gotta we just gotta send it. We got places to stop by, things to get, things to rig up. We gotta have the right gear at the right time, at the right spots, and you gotta catch the right fish. That's the other thing. We're not going for no little fish here. We're going for eight foot plus that's crazy saying <laughs> yeah i don't know if you guys would believe it or not but in, in a non home depot related video we still made it back baby <laughs> we're at home depot yeah i uh one i come here uh every morning uh, it's like meditation and then two we do actually need something for 
the trip from here. We're also gonna get like a cool AC fan because believe it or not, heat stroke is a thing. It's 105 out. You know, sitting dead in that with no wind, trying to catch a gar, we're gonna get something to cool us down if we can find that in a massive jug of water. You're literally watching hopefully history in the making. It might not be this episode, it might, uh, but it's, it's gonna happen. We're breaking the world record. Oh, that's a box one. Literally, Arctic air. You're telling me we can bring an air conditioning unit to the river? Quick and easy top fill water tank. Oh, you gotta plug it into something though. You that's, do? that's not gonna work. Look at that. Oh. I'm sticking this on you, Jake Juan, so it's whatever you think. USB charging cable. Runs up to six hours per charge. Stay cool and comfortable. You want this thing? Yeah. Okay. Okay. You got it. All right, well, maybe we shouldn't bring Nate. <laughs> I might not even use the snap swivel. Wow. Yeah, I might literally just go wire instead of using a swivel. Oh. Because the last swivels were bending out. I mean, if we're going to catch a 350 pound fish, I want to go straight wire. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to absolutely gang gang skirt this. this oh gar. my goodness. Where are we naming the gar? I mean, Shawana. Gar are really old, right? Everybody knows. What's a really old name? Everybody knows big fat old ladies are named Gladys. Oh my God, that is so right. So sorry if your name is Gladys. <laughs> Gladys the Gator Gar. Oh Gladys, that's the name of the world record. Oh my God. Well, well, how are nice, you? Good. Nice, yeah, to meet you. nice to meet you too, man. That's crazy. Went to the Trinity and found a lady floating, like like a dead body. That is wild. Uh, early 80s. Early 80s. Yeah. Hey, there's. I mean, that's still like a thing that happens to guys when we went out fishing with them. Like they're a second week fishing together last year. They found a body floating and they hooked it and brought it in. And yeah, I mean, the whole police department was there and everything. Well, I mean, I don't even know. Oh, like my well, dad. Sounds like it's not a good place to hide one. That's crazy. That's maybe why the gar are getting so big. Oh, maybe not a good thing. <laughs> hey, no, it was nice meeting you guys. Hey, do you mind if I get a picture? Yeah, yeah, no, of course. Uh, awesome. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah, I'm big there, by the way. I'm Brenton. Brenton. Nice to meet you. Yeah. yeah, I mean, 80 pound braid should work. Size never mattered to me, anyways. <laughs> my Fair enough, bro. That. that is an absolute massive carp. Will these work? <laughs> Came from the ocean. Oh, the macro work. Oh my gosh, that thing is so big. 72 dollars. 72 okay. Yeah. 72 dollars. No way. Oh no. They're Print it. Print it. Welcome home, sweetie. <laughs> I'm gonna need you. Holy moly, that thing That is thing huge. is so big. <laughs> His name is Hoss. Hoss? <laughs> that right there is what we're gonna catch some big old car with. <laughs> oh my gosh, that thing is huge. Good old tail feet. Alright, we got about three hours to see what we can make shake. We came at the perfect time. So if we're gonna catch uh, Gladys, if we're gonna catch Gladys, it's gonna be it's gonna be right now. Holy oh, snake. Give me a brick. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> I almost really did brick right there, guys. I don't like snakes at all. <laughs> We post videos catching monster alligator gar and look at all the people that come out here and try and do it. And just leave the trash. <laughs> wow, that's annoying. Yeah, there's literally trash all over here. I haven't seen anything in the news about a new world, re new world record though, so I'm not worried. <laughs> Give it another one. Give it another one? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. And you said that brings them in, right? Yep, that's their call. That brings like the fish into us. Yep. Does that normally bring them to the bait or does it bring it closer to us? Uh, to the bait. To the bait. Directly okay. to the bait. Directly to the bait. They could, so 
you hear that like wet raspy sound in there oh. yeah so it actually tingles the the, the line and that's where it's telling and, them to and, go and it sends sound waves directly down the line and it stops at the bait so and that's it stops the point. at the bait and then they hear it uh-huh brings them in okay so You're, you know livingston lures yeah it's like that but with my mouth and it it, it, it directly attracts cigar it's not the same like the living the difference is the livingston lures was like trying to make a bleeding shad sound yeah i'm making like a mating call for the guard kiss. Okay, um, how often do you do it? Oh, every, it really doesn't take much. I mean, they'll, they'll come for miles. There was a big one right there. I told you it works. Okay, so now we're just trying to wait for yeah, a while. Yeah, I mean, they'll, they'll, they'll migrate from miles away. And come in. Yeah, to, to experience it. They know it means that good is <laughs> around. <laughs> and so. I've lost confidence in this spot right now. Not, <laughs> not that it's bad, it's just that we're on a time crunch from like six to nine. It's the when it's gonna happen. I don't think this is gonna be where it's gonna happen. Or at least where we do catch a monster, you know? So I'm gonna, I'm gonna reel these in, this bait, I'm just gonna throw it back out. So uh, onto, uh, onto the next spot. Just so you know, boys, I avoided my fear of spiders for this walk. You're overcoming your fear, Brenton. Holy Yep, so you guys know I have a phobia of spiders, so if you look right here, I'm really trying my best right now. I got thorns going into my legs. And this is the most treacherous walk we've ever done. We went through the entire Amazon in Colombia and Venezuela, and it wasn't half that bad. Oh, oh my god. Was that a huge one? It was a giant. Really? Yeah, that was Horrifying cool. walk I've ever done in my entire life. Um, like I said, I have a phobia of spiders. I don't think you guys know, but like, good chance I got like 20 ticks on me that I had to pull off. Yeah, that was off to at least a six right in front of you though. We're already seeing so many more fish opposed to earlier. Gluck Gluck 3000. Yeah, so Nate's been trying a new technique. He's playing top 85 country hits because um, he thinks the gar like country music. Originally, he was playing Sam Hunt. No, don't know much about him, but the gar were not fans of Sam Hunt. They love Cole though. They like Cole Swindle? Yeah, Cole Swindle. They like Cole Swindle though. They've started to bust more, so that's good. Um, Sam Hunt, not as much though. Just so you guys are updated on how the process of catching a world record goes. Oh my gosh, you can literally see him. We're following him around. That's about a four footer right there swimming. Okay, That's so, pretty cool. let's see if we can find another one. We got the drone right here and we're just staring at like, I mean, what do you think that had to be? Probably close to seven foot. Close. I mean, if not more, it's, it's hard to tell on the drone, but that was a huge fish. We saw it from, oh my God. They're going nuts. We saw it from way high in the air, and I came down on it. That is wild. There's, oh my god, look at that one. Look at that one right there. Oh, yeah. They are everywhere. They should be here any minute. Oh, there's one already coming towards us. Yeah. Right there, they're already coming towards us. Oh, there's another one. All right. Come on, there was another one. Okay, all right, that was all we needed. Something needs to take the bait now. Come on, please, 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 please. Run with it. We were about to leave, like we took an L. We couldn't seem to get a fish to bite and we just started having something run. Oh my gosh, please run with it. Oh my God. Oh my she God. Has oh my goodness. There we go. There we go. That fish is moving now. Uh, I'm going to run out of line. I'm going to have to set it. You ready? Oh yeah. Please let this be the fish we need. Oh, oh. oh my goodness. The mouth aren't that big. No. Oh, here we go. Here we go. It's picking it back up. It's picking it back up. It, it had complete slack. Here it goes. Here it goes. We should get a run. That one peeled. He's chewing. The fastest I've ever seen one rip. This one went complete slack. Oh. Nate is single-handedly potentially giving us something out of the night. Oh, oh my God. We, we literally told ourselves five more minutes. This one has a fish on it. Oh, he's taking it. He's taking it. Yeah. Oh, oh my God. 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 That's a good fish. Wow, why did you that? That's a good fish. Ah, oh, dude, I'm gonna run out of line. I have to set the hook. It's... 
Oh, come on. Come on, he's such a small piece of bait. Oh, it stopped. It's eating it. It's eating it. That's on, that's on. That's on. That's on, that's on. That's a fish and it's on. Oh my God. Come on, Pete. Oh my God. Yep, that's a big fish. That's a big fish. Oh my gosh. This is a big fish. Oh God. Uh, come on. Oh, there we go. Uh, uh. Why does this look darker? No way. Oh my, my God. goodness. Oh my, oh my goodness. Oh my God. Yo. Oh my God. Yo. Oh my Yo. God. Yo. Oh my Yo. God. I think you broke another record. Oh my, oh my God. goodness. That's the biggest catfish we've ever caught. Oh my wow. goodness. Wow. Oh my gosh. Bro. I hate catfish. <sighs> mm, I don't like these. Oh, he's heavier than I thought he is. Oh. That's not even a flathead. Oh my gosh. That's what? Close to a 50 pound catfish. It's gotta be 40 or 50 pounds. It's at least 30 pounds. Still got you, GoPro. Hope my phone doesn't die. Now. Not what we intended on catching. Oh no, get him beat, get him beat, no! No, man, no! You think I'd let go of him? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that was hard, that was tough. Give me help, give me help, come here, let me just try to... It's a big catfish. Let me get him off. And definitely the biggest I've ever caught in my entire life. <sighs> oh my God, it's hard to hold this thing. Oh my goodness, B. <sighs> timer just went off. That was our timer to leave. We broke the rod, caught. An absolute mammoth. I don't think y'all understand how big this thing is. I'll give you one more look. Uh, oh my God. Big guy. He's gone. Yeah, it was, <clears throat> I mean, <clears throat> I lift those 50 pound feed bags to feed the animals all the time. And it gives me like a good, you know, measurement, like a scale in my head. Yeah. So it was definitely pushing that 40, 50 pound range. For sure, bro. I'm thinking it was closer to 50. Its head was just so fat. That's gonna be a giant one day. Oh my gosh. Definitely the biggest one of those I've ever caught in my life. Oh, Brinson's gone. Oh my god. Well, we had another fish, but it swam down into a hole, so I tried to dive down and get it. But, uh, Snapped both rods oh. on catfish. <laughs> so it was, we kind of figured out along the way it was the type of bait we got. That was a buffalo carp. We always use common. I've heard that buffalo isn't good, but I didn't. When I thought from a guard point of view, if you swam by a piece of bait, you would eat it. Although every time we got a bite from a guard, we would grab it and it would let it go. So we're not gonna Doesn't use it. make any difference to me. Black, white, I eat it all. So. Oh my goodness. So, I don't know why I thought the guard would be the same way. Wow. <laughs> we're, uh, we're not done though. We're gonna catch it. This is just phase number one. So we just gotta walk back through this whole thing in the dark. Literally spider, snake, and tick infested forest to the truck. Whew. That was brutal. Cigar. <laughs> <laughs> Ow. Ah, oh, that hurts so bad. Oh my spider web I just walked through. I'm gonna die. I'm literally, I'm gonna die. Yeah. Woo, woo, woo. Oh, watch your step, you're gonna go down. I can't, uh, <clears throat> I can't figure out how to get out. We've been trying for about 20 minutes to get back up and we can't figure out how to do it. There's, there's no way, it's too steep. Um, where we got up, where we got down, the whole hill collapsed. Oh my. So we can't get back up. Um, like our only option is like strip clothes, swim around the bend of the river and try and get up over there. But, but we I have, can't swim. So there's our issue. <laughs> um, we don't know what we're gonna do. I mean, it's been a good 15, 20 minutes of us trying to figure this out. Um, and there's massive spiders every square inch we look down. By the way, I have arachnophobia. Um, I would, I mean, I'd wrestle a tiger shark, but I would <laughs> rather break my arm uh, than be near a spider. So I'm having a little bit of anxiety right now. <laughs> But we've got to get out of here. My voice is gone because of our, our catfish. My oh, goodness. God. Yeah. So 
I don't, I don't know what to do right now. I literally don't know what to do. All right, one second. The stick is in the way. Watch out for that thing. Oh, oh, oh God. Oh, you good? Ah, okay. Okay. Mm. Oh, these are thorn bushes. These are thorn bushes. Oh, it's thorn bushes. It's literal thorn bushes. And my Crocs are in my hand. We feel this. Oh my God. My face good? Yeah, you're good. Yeah, you're good. Okay. Mm. Last thing I need is ticks all over me. Oh my gosh. You know what was helping me in there? There was lightning bugs. Like the little, little bugs. They're helping me see. <laughs> How's that feel? It feels good. Oh. oh, that was extremely painful. See, my body feels weird. I I was trying to like lead the way going through that, and the stuff I stepped on, I couldn't wear I couldn't wear the shoes because it would slide off my feet every step. All cut up everywhere. <sighs> I'm like bleeding all over the back of my legs. I can't believe we made it out, bro. Yeah, we couldn't figure out how to get out of there. That was a good 45-ish minutes of us trying to get out of there. Eight minutes to get down. I was genuinely scared, bro. Yeah, 45 to get out. Like I, I thought we at one point I realized we went in a few circles because I saw our own tra like trail. Oh my god, that was awful. Yeah, next time we're definitely taking a boat to the spot. At least we caught a big catfish. No world record though. Part two coming soon. Click the subscribe button. I love you guys. Catch you on the next episode of Fanatic. Peace. End it, Nate. Oh my, oh my goodness. God, Nate. Oh my Did you God. break, baby girl? Are you okay? <laughs>